myself is cl ratod assistant professor department of mechanical engineering walchand institute of technology solapur today's topic is orthographic projections of simple object at the end of this lecture student will be able to draw the orthographic projections of projections of simple object so this is the simple object so we have to select it uh, this uh, simple object so this is the object we have to draw this is the 3d object we will going to convert this into 3d into 2d so this is the direction of view this is the front view top view and the side view so first what i have to do i have to take the reference line so this is the reference line so another reference line i have to take thank you myself is cl ratod assistant professor department of mechanical engineering walchand district of technology solapur today's topic is orthographic projections of simple object at the end of this lecture student will be able to draw the orthographic projections of projections of simple object so this is the simple object so we have to select it uh, this uh, simple object so this is the object we have to draw this is the 3d object we will going to convert this into 3d into 2d so this is the direction of view this is the front view top view and the side view so first what i have to do i have to take the reference line so this is the reference line so another reference line i have to take the length length is given height is given so this is the x y x dash and y dash so length is given so l is length is given is uh, is 98 and width is given 42 and height is given this is the 20 20 plus 21 and 21 radius is given so total height is 42 plus 20 62 is the height 62 mm is the height 42 mm is the width and 98 98 is the length so what i have to do i have to take the length that is equal to 98 and then from this point what i have to do i have to take the 20 mm so 20 mm when we see from the front we will going to see this for this slot and this slot so for that so 20 height i'll be going to take so from this i'll going to take the 20 mm and from this this side also i have to take 20 mm and then i'll going to complete the block so 20 mm block i have to complete this and another length is another dimension is given that is 6 mm so from this i have to take from this 6 by 14 block i have to prepare so from this i have to take 14 and this side also i have to take 14 and from this i have to take 6 mm above and similarly here i have to take 6 mm and i'll going to draw the this block complete block and i'll going to complete this block so next what i have to do i'll going to select the axis line so i have to take 
divide this 98 by 2 that is 49. So, I have to take the 49 from this. Then I have to take the axis line. I am going to take the axis line. Then, so from this, so from this end, 24 is given. So, I have to take 24 mm from this. I have to take 24 mm and I am going to draw the axis line. And from this 24, 50 mm is uh, 50 mm center to center distance is given. So I have to take 50 mm and I'm going to select another axis line. And the diameter, when we see from the front, this hole is not going to see. Then what I have to do? So this diameter uh, dimension is given 12 mm. So on both sides, I have to take 6 mm, 6 mm both sides. And similarly here 6 mm on both sides. Then so when when we see from the front it will not going to see these dimensions for that I have to draw the dotted line. Similarly I have to draw the dotted line here also. And then so from this point so 21 is the given at the I have to take the 21 mm from this point and I am going to draw the another axis line for this hole. So then so when we see from the front this hole is not going to see then what I have to do from from this uh, center to radius is given 21. 21 mm. So I'm going to take 21 from this, and then when we see uh, when when we see from the front, we're not going to see this video. So for that, another slot is given that is 14 mm. So what I have to do? I have to take 7 mm, 7 mm each side. And I am going to complete the this slot up to so this is how we're going to complete the this block and at the center this hole is not going to visible to us then what I have to do so its radius is given 21 then and its uh, dimension its its dimension is given 20 then i have to do i have to take 20, 10 mm each side and i will going to draw the dotted line for that hole so this is how we are going to draw the uh, front view when uh, when we see from the top we are going to see this this lot and these two holes and this surface both the surface and what I have to do I have to project the lines I have to project the lines this is the projection so I have to project these lines this is the axis line and this is the projection of another line this is the axis line So this is the line, this is the axis line I have to select and this is the another line. So this is the projection and width is given 42. So what I have to do, I have to prepare the block of 42 by uh, 98. So this is the uh, 48 by 92 block I have to prepare and then what I have to do I have to select one axis line dividing this 42 by 2 then 
I'm going to get 21. So I'm going to draw the dotted line here. Then, so now pause the video and uh, think about the top view. So about this hole, how it going to look in this top view? I think you drawn this top view of this hole. So I'm going to show you how to, how to draw this uh, top view. So what I have to do, I have to take the distance, this as the distance, this is the center and I have to draw this top view of this hole. Then, and when we see from the top, this hole is not going to see. So for that, I have to prepare the, so this uh, surface. So before that, I have to draw this edge. So we're going to see this complete edge. So this is dark line. And when we see from the top, this edge is not going to visible to us. So for that, I have to draw the dotted line. Similarly for this also, I'm going to draw the dotted line and then when we see from the top we're going to see this edge so for that I have to draw the complete dark line here also and here then so when we see from the top this hole is not going to be visible so for that what I have to do I have to take uh, 10 mm each side and I'm going to draw the dotted line for that one So now what I have to do, I have to uh, mention the dimensions. This is the 42 and this is the 98 length is given. And this height is 20 mm is given. And this length is given that is 14 mm. And this is also given 6 mm. And from this it is 21. And from this end, this is the 24 is given and center to center distance is given that is 50 mm and here is also we are going to take 21 is the radius and this whole dimension is given that is 20 mm and similarly this hole is also given 20 mm this is how we are going to calculate uh, we are going to draw the simple object Thank you.